automotive giants Mercedes and Stellantis have temporarily halted their ambitious European battery factory projects. The decision, announced by their joint venture automotive sales company, raises questions about the future direction of vehicle battery technology and production in Europe. Automotive sales company formed in 2021 to establish a robust European battery supply chain, secured a substantial 4.38 billion euros investment earlier this year. The funds were earmarked for the construction of four factories, including one already operational in Duveren, France. However, the companies have now halted work on an upcoming German facility and paused preparations for another in Italy. Automotive Cells Company maintains that this is not a termination of the projects, the decision is merely a significant strategic reassessment. The company cites a need to remain, flexible, and responsive to evolving market trends as the rationale behind the pause. Notably, Automotive Cells Company's head, Jan Vincent, pointed to a perceived slowdown in European vehicle demand, a claim that seems at odds with recent sales figures showing a 14.8% year-over-year increase in April. The pause in construction comes amid speculation that automotive cells company is contemplating a shift toward lithium iron phosphate cells. While offering lower energy density than the nickel manganese cobalt cells commonly used in vehicles, the iron phosphate cells boast several key advantages. They are cheaper, more durable, and rely on more straightforward mineral sourcing. This potential shift towards iron phosphate technology aligns with a broader trend in the vehicle market. Several automakers, particularly those targeting the mass market segment, have begun incorporating iron phosphate cells into their vehicles to reduce costs. The success of Chinese automakers, who have leveraged iron phosphate technology to offer competitively priced vehicles, has further fueled interest in this alternative battery chemistry. Despite the delay, a move towards iron phosphate cells could ultimately prove beneficial for automotive cells company and the European vehicle market.